Hey guys, Griffin Cooper here from Able Way Tech. Got another live trading example for you for this week. And uh, this one is using the morning hook setup. So let's get into it. Okay, so this was the morning hook pattern on our symbol of choice, uh, EWW, the Mexico ETF. Um, always moving well, so we like that, that symbol. Um, you can see here is our, our opening of the day, and we had this gap down and a uh, slight sell-off, which immediately created the oversold condition on Williams Percent R. So we had an uptick in the MACD histogram. We had our oversold condition on Williams Percent R, and then we were just waiting for our entry, which was a universal entry that we got right here when it took out the high of this bar. And our stop was at that uh, provisional low of the day, which then uh, did end up being the low of the day. So we got a really nice uh, move up. What I've been uh, experimenting with is our Uwe exits, where we wait for, uh, I had a PSAR indicator on here. So I basically just waited for, I was waiting for that PSAR to get above our entry. And what actually happened before that is we had, we had our risk here, uh, you know, our initial execution risk. And price got all the way past that right here. So at that point, I didn't want to lose money on that trade. So that was when I ratcheted the stop up. And then I just thought, you know, how can I stay in this um, without worrying about every little pullback and stuff. And I just said, well, let me just use the uh, the middle of the river and just took that, you know, that's the middle of the river that we use. And that ended up with a nice uh, to our exit when we got this, uh, this deeper pullback here. This chart is a lot more sparse, you know, compared to the other setups we use, you know, not many indicators, which I like. It's a uh, it's it's more, um, you know, I find there's a simple uh, elegance to this to this setup that I really like. And it happens right in the morning in the first hour, uh, typically, so that uh, you can get a, a trade working right away that rather than trying to swing trade it, you can get in with a little bit better entry. So I'm liking this a lot. Like I said, it was kind of like uh, it felt like driving a new car with a different set of indicators on the chart. And I think that's something kind of give us a new view and we've been using the same kind of set of indicators on a chart to mix it up. It kind of really helped me to to see the charts a little bit different and uh, it was really fun. Click the link in the description to check out our trading courses at ablewaytech.com. You can also sign up for our free weekly newsletter there. And don't forget to subscribe if you'd like to see more trading examples and trading lessons posted each week. Thanks for watching.